Right now, officers in the metro are working to make sure your student is safe as they head to and from school. Take a look at this. This picture is from police showing a driver going nearly 100 miles per hour through a school zone. They got it from one of many cameras now watching the roads around local schools. 11 Alive's Jerry Carnes has been following efforts to better protect school zones. Police tell him the new cameras mean those who speed will pay. Speed past Church Street Elementary School here in Riverdale, and police will know even if there's not an officer here. The sign says it all. Cameras are watching. Riverdale police say too often drivers refuse to slow down when school's in session. Sometimes flashing lights along with the frantic arm motions of a Clayton County police officer aren't enough. As she walks her niece to Swint Elementary School, Haley Rounds is comforted to know that as this officer attempts to calm traffic on Highway 138, there's also an electronic eye watching. They move so quickly in between traffic. I think a lot of people, they don't take it seriously until it's their child. Cameras armed with speed detection are now posted outside several schools around Clayton County. They're in Gwinnett County as well, where they've captured photos like this of vehicles traveling as fast as 92 miles an hour through a school zone. The cities of Lawrenceville, Jonesboro, and Riverdale are among the areas where cameras started operating this school year for the purpose of issuing tickets. Riverdale Police Sergeant Victor Ortega says during a trial period here, drivers started getting the message. It should be 25, and we still see violators doing 45, 50 miles an hour on the school zones, which is really is unnecessary. Everybody gets caught about the money. It's not about the money. It's about getting compliance. Fines vary from one area to another and by law are only for drivers going more than 10 miles an hour over the posted speed limit during school hours. Gwinnett County certainly hasn't had an issue catching violators. In one year, with cameras outside three schools, Gwinnett Police issued more than 25,000 citations. Haley Rounds is ready to see even more cameras around schools in Clayton County. This is a lot of traffic first thing in the morning. She says she can use all the help she can get to navigate busy Highway 138 with a first grader in tow. You saw the picture last year. A camera caught a driver going 92 miles an hour through a school zone in Gwinnett County. It happened again on the first day of school, 92 in a school zone.